as if it wasn't good enough for CRST to solve the nation's logistics crisis by working directly with the White House, as we recently found out. Now they're here to solve the contract crisis. Don't you think a contract keeps you tied down? Well, who knows better than that at CRST, but hey, they're going to solve it in a new ad that they have. Let's see what they've got to say. Hello and welcome to Trucking Answers. I'm Mark, your financial contract host. And CRST says contracts keep people like they feel like they're tied down to a job and can't really freely do their job. Oh, who knew about that? Well, CRST has a solution. They're not going to give out contracts anymore. They're giving you a driver financial agreement. That's right. They renamed it. Oh, yeah. They simply renamed it something different. You can pay it off in six to eight months, depending on how many miles you drive. Isn't that great? That sounds suspiciously like a contract, but hey, what do I know? I'm not a lawyer. I don't even act like a lawyer with Susan Day. Here's the thing. Call it what you want, right? You're still stuck there for the length of the contract, and we know that CRST very aggressively enforces that contract with other companies because they take them to court over it. I love this. We learned about this from 1984. Newspeak, good is bad. Garbage is delicious. Work is fun. All these kind of things. Now contracts are simply driver financial agreements. Contracts are so old, they just keep you all tied up like you can't even do your job. I don't have a contract, I just have an agreement. Boy, that sounds way better. I applaud CRST for coming up with new words for the same old thing. That sounds just like how that company works. Again, as I always say in my opinion, no one should ever work for, drive for, or have anything to do with CRST. It may be a gold rush, but you should rush yourself right out of there don't sign a contract with them or a driver financial agreement without talking to a licensed attorney. All right, don't you love how we could just change words around and then they're all fun. Maybe there's balloons. I assume they have one of those popper things, those party poppers when you sign your driver financial agreement. It pops and everybody laughs and we all have a good time and then you go back to your bunk room where they've already turned the lights out. Thanks for watching and we'll be back soon with another trucking answers.